A staff member, a, a staff member at a correctional facility for troubled boys behind bars now and now without a job. She's accused of giving two juveniles permission to have sex and then acting as their lookout. Last night, St. John's County Sheriff's deputies arrested 24-year-old LaPortia McCall. She worked at Hastings Youth Academy in the town of Hastings. Channel 4's Vic Michalucci spoke with investigators. Wow, that's crazy. The allegations are shocking for this man who's a former supervisor at Hastings Youth Academy. I have kids and, you know, pretty much when your kids come to a place like this, you expect them to be safe, you know. It's a privately run facility, but it uses state money to house these juvenile offender boys. They do live here. They're not able to come or go because essentially this is a form of punishment and rehabilitation. But St. John's County Sheriff's deputies believe one of the staffers here, LaPortia McCall, broke the law. We received allegations that this individual uh, was in fact um, allowing two juveniles to have sexual activity um, while she in fact had guarded the door. The boys were 14 and 17 years old and detectives believe she also watched it. Yeah, we believe that to be the case. Detectives say surveillance video shows McCall on the lookout, apparently, so they didn't get caught. She's now out of that facility and into this one, jail, facing felony charges of contributing to lewd and lascivious battery and child neglect. Her job was to prevent that sort of uh, behavior. This former employee says now he's concerned about the safety of the children inside the academy. So is this a safe place, in your opinion, for kids to go? It can be. If you got a proper, proper staff coverage, it can be. But right now? Definitely not. And detectives say they're going to continue to work with the state to see if anything else inappropriate happened here. In Hastings, I'm Vic Michalucci, Channel 4, The Local Station.